OK, so well, I want to run a little bit of an experiment. If you looked at me, you'd think, I'm probably more comfortable behind the wheel of a four-wheel drive, or maybe even a ute. I don't think most of you would look at me and think I'm a hot hatch type of guy. Well, I've been given the newest model by City Toyota. Now, I know most of you ladies are going to absolutely love it. Well, I'm going to check it out and see if I can appreciate its handling, its styling and its power. Meet the all-new Toyota Yaris ZR. Let's get a few things straight right away. This is the ZR, which is the top of the line spec level for the new Yaris. Toyota have made a few hefty changes this time around, and I think I might just enjoy this drive a little bit more than I first thought. The 2015 Yaris is only available with five doors, and this one, the ZR, is exclusively automatic. It's jammed with safety features and a few more features that are designed just to put a smile on your face. The new inbuilt touchscreen is impressive. It works just like your smartphone, with tap, drag and flick functionality, so you can easily navigate your way around all the features. Plus, the ZR comes with satellite navigation, which is missing on the two less specced up versions. There are other buttons too, like a handy phone switch snugly fitted to the steering wheel. So how does it drive? Well, the engineers at Toyota have taken on a little bit of criticism regarding handling response. In the new Yaris, they've stiffened the body shell and they've dialed the suspension back just a little bit. The result is a more predictable linear drive and surprisingly, a reduction in vibration and road noise entering the cabin. They've done a really good job, actually. The noise in the cabin is reduced by the addition of updated seals throughout the car and thicker, sound-absorbing materials used in the interior. I'm a big fan of the seats in the ZR. They make you feel secure and comfortable, and the overall feel of the inside is sporty meets stylish, which is hard to do in a small car with this price tag. Wayne, I tell you what, I love the new Yaris, especially the ZR, which I've been driving today. I'm surprised at the room and especially the overall performance. Yes, Aaron, it's powered by a 1.5-litre four-cylinder motor and the fuel economy gives you a 6.3 litres per 100 kilometres as an average cycle. OK, now what features could you tell me that you are attracted to most? Today, Aaron, you've been reviewing the ZR, but what I like is there's three great features standard across all grades now, and that's reverse camera, a touch screen and cruise control. It's exactly what you want in your new car, isn't it? It's fantastic. You may have already noticed, but the exterior styling of the new Yaris is nothing short of incredible. And by that, I mean that they have gone to town on the old model. Land and boring are things of the past, and the ZR is absolutely covered in aggressive styling features, which I love. Just have a look at this front grille. It's much bigger than the previous model, and it's there to make a statement. It's telling you, watch out because you're about to be overtaken. And the ZR gets a few extra toys that the others don't such as these auto-leveling LED headlights, side skirts, 15-inch alloy wheels and a spoiler. In terms of safety, the Yaris ZR has a ton of airbags, seven in total, and comes with electronic stability control. You know, it's not the biggest car on the road, but then it's not supposed to be. It's not the fastest and it's not a people mover. But what this car does do well and better than all the rest is make driving fun. And if you get the ZR model with all the add-ons, this small car becomes one big surprise. If you'd like to get behind the wheel of your very own Yaris, make sure you jump on to citytoyota.net.au. Now, I'm off. I've got this booked for a few more hours and I'm going to have some fun.